Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this afternoon with Frankie and Rich and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Frankie's ability to understand and respond to his formal on-leash obedience commands indoors. Now he is sitting very nicely at Rich's left which is where all of our obedience training is done and the first thing that we're going to take a moment to introduce is the training equipment that we're using. Rich is using a regular six foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of the leash folded neatly in his right hand. That leaves his left hand free to give any little correction that we give and the only correction that we give is a little tug and release on the training collar. And that is the second piece of equipment that we're using. Frankie's going to come home with his very own training equipment and you're going to be taught how to use that properly during your follow up training session. Now the first exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is healing. Healing is very important exercise because it is proper leash walking. One of the things that clients complain about the worst is that their dogs drag them on walks. So the command is Frankie heal. Frankie heal. Now at this point Frankie has a job to do. And that is to maintain pace with you when you're walking. Whether you're indoors or outdoors he should sit Frankie. automatically when you stop walking and he should walk at your pace. So you see that you can work your dog in a small enclosed environment. You don't have to be outside. And this gives you quality time to spend with your puppy doing something that you both enjoy. And you see him looking up at Rich, he's very focused and this helps to develop self-control and maturity. Stay. The next exercise is the sit-stay. It is a hand and a voice command and because it's a stationary exercise you do not use his name. You're going to lengthen out your time and your distance when you're working at home. And this is great exercise to practice inside. When Rich returns back to him he walks counterclockwise all the way back to his shoulders. When he gets back to the shoulders he stops. And at this point Frankie expects to get another command. And if you notice, Rich doesn't let him drop his head when he's yeah. healing with him. If you have control of the dog's head, you have control of the dog. If you're letting him drop his head, then it's time for him to just be a puppy and play. Stay. No. Yep. Okay. Now he started to anticipate Stay. the next command, and but that's not what Rich was asking him to do. So he told him no, he gently healed him out of it, and he went back to the sit-stay. And the next command that we're going to demonstrate is the come on command. Frankie, come. Frankie's been taught to come and sit. So no more jumping all over. Frankie, back to heel, back sitting. Frankie, heel. He's a very smart kid <laughs> and he's very focused which really helps because you can see that he enjoys doing it. This helps to develop self-control, focus, maturity, all these things that Stay. all puppies need. comes right in and sits and his eye contact is really really good because it's warm, it's comfortable, it's inviting Now the next command that Rich is going to demonstrate is the down from a heel position so with the dog seated at your left you're going to take your left open palm Push down. it straight down toward the ground stay. and give the one word command to down and stay. stay. Your long down stay, you can practice while you're watching TV. Stay. And again, no. you're going to lengthen out your time and your distance. Stay. When Rich returns back to him, he walks all the way around him again. Just as he did on the sit stay, he stops at his shoulders and then he's ready to give another command. Frankie, yep. And we will demonstrate that down from a heel position again for you. Down. 
Left stay. open palm, straight down toward the ground, the one word command to down and stay. That recall exercise again. He's a little distracted. You know, he didn't sit, and you saw Rich give that gentle tug. Told him no sit. And the very last exercise that we're going to demonstrate Sorry. for you is the down from a distance. This is typically a harder exercise because you're not right next to the dog. Down. Perfectly done. First time. Now Frankie's done a great job while he's been here at school. He's a really, really nice puppy. We've enjoyed having him. We know you're so anxious to get him home. Thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company, and we will see you very soon.